The Nampa School District has put forth a proposal recommending to the school board to consolidate buildings, specifically to close three buildings and reallocate three others. Schools that could possibly close would be Greenhurst, Union School, and Gateways. Central Elementary, West and Snake River would be repurposed to accommodate these building closures. Central will then become home to Nova and our preschool. Um, Snake River will be home to Gateways program and um, West will become home to Union and our Nampa Academy. So we have plans for those buildings and then the other buildings then that would be vacated would be raised. All this despite the growth in the city. And this does not come as a huge shock to us because we did have experts go out and look at what um, lay, lay in store for us and their report showed that this was going to happen and we pretty much followed that graph um, just as it was presented back in 2018. The students in Central, West and Snake River elementaries would be spread out to the remaining schools through a reboundary process that Tuck says would also benefit their students' curriculum. So we have a lot of schools out there that are nowhere near capacity, maybe 50, 60 percent. That's not optimal to have too many of those schools. So by um, reducing the number of schools, so for instance elementary taking it from 14 down to 11, it's going to allow us to be a lot more fiscally responsible and also do a better job of providing the program that we want to do in the way we'd like to do it so that we're not having to provide duplicate programming at a lot of different elementary schools. The district, by combining all the schools together, sits at an average of 68% attendance right now in a single building with no single building at 100% or even greater capacity. Tuck says the target capacity for a building is 80%. Fewer buildings means fewer classrooms. Fewer classrooms also means fewer teachers. The district realizes the anxiety around the unknowns for teachers, but are optimistic. We'll have a need for less staff, teachers and staff. But what we're hoping is that just through attrition, just the natural end of the year, people moving or retiring or choosing other paths, that we will be able to absorb everybody. Um, there are, of course, no guarantees, but we really hope to be able to keep everybody and just find a new place for them.